Habit three, put first things first. Work, then play. This is Mike and Sully. They're best friends, and they have two very different stories. Mike is hardworking and has studied many hours so that he can pass his scaring test. Sully is more laid back and thinks he can pass his scaring test without studying. Mike sets himself a goal and starts to study. He knows his scare test is coming up and he needs to work hard before he plays so that he can get a good score on his scare test. Sully decides that instead of studying, he's going to spend his time having fun. Because Mike worked hard, his grades were good, whereas Sully's were not so good. Sully realizes that to get what he wants, he's going to have to work harder and start practicing and studying. Mike helps him study and helps him train to become a good scarer. And Sully helps Mike realize that it's okay to have a little fun too. By the end of the movie, we see that Mike and Sully's plans didn't go as they expected. But even though that happened, they learned that through hard work, they could still achieve their goal. So they started working to become the best at whatever job they were given until eventually they reached their goal to become scarers. Now let's take a look at some scenes from the movie and see if the characters put first things first. We're going to look at Sully and see how his choices affected the things that happened to him in the future. Everyone take out your scaring textbooks and open them to chapter one. Hey, bub. I borrowed pencil. Forgot all my stuff. Ah. Yeah, there we go. That'll get it. In this scene, we see that Sully not only shows up late for class, but also comes without a pencil or any paper. He shows us that he's not prepared. He's not putting first things first. He's not ready to come to class and learn. Here's another clip of Sully and his choices. See if you can figure out where he went wrong. That is some remarkable improvement, Michael. One frightening face does not a scare him make, Mr. Sully. Sully's teacher was not impressed with his performance because he scared the same way at the beginning of the year as he did now. He showed no growth or change. He didn't learn anything. So, how are some ways that you can put first things first? Talk with your grown-ups about your most important jobs or responsibilities, such as doing homework, making the bed, or taking out the garbage. Do your chores before being asked. Do the hardest part of your homework first. Think of something you've been putting off for a while, like cleaning your room, and go do that first. So remember, be like Mike. Work first, then play. <laughs>